Hey guys, I'm here with my Kindle, and today I'm just going to tell you guys um, what books I have on here. So we're going to start off with my books to read. Um, the Help by Katherine Stuckett. That's what I'm reading now. Um, the Essence Conspiracy by S. Eric Wachell. Um, that was a free book. The Silent, or just Silent Witness by Rebecca Forster. Uh, that was not free. I can't remember how much it was. Uh, I don't think it was too much. Three or four dollars. Um, I read the book before that, which was called Hostile Witness by Rebecca Forster as well. And that one was free. Um, they're not a sequel. They're not sequels or trilogies or anything. Each book is of hers is an individual story. It just has the same characters, if you know what I mean. Um, Children of the Fog by Cheryl K. Tardif was a free book. This Time Forever by Patricia Paris was also free. The Red Church by Scott Nicholson was free as well. The Plan by Bernard Jacobs um, was 99 cents. Moonspell by Samantha Young was free, um, but it is the first book in, I believe, a trilogy. I'm not sure what the other books are called or anything, and I don't believe they're free. I think you have to pay for them. But that is the first book. Um, the Brevity of Roses by Linda Cassidy Lewis was uh, a free book as well. Trouble in Mudbug by let me go Let's see by Jana De Leon. Um, that was free. At Risk by Kit Ehrman was a free book as well. Then there's Letter to My Daughter by Maya Angelou. Um, that was not a free book. That was a book that I had actually gotten for school. But um, I never read the full book, so I put it on my to-read list. Uh, Uncle Tom's Cabin by Harriet Beecher Stowe. Ryan's, um, that was free, but Ryan's Return by Barbara Freethy. Um was free as well. River Song by Tess Hardwick was a free book. Uh, Out of Time by Deborah Truscott was also free. And Double Dare by Rhonda Nelson was free. So I got a lot of free books, which is great. You know, if you don't have to spend money on books, you know, then don't, you know. Um, there are some books here. Well, my, in my references, I'll just show you what's in really quick. Not much. I have the dictionary that came on here, the user guide, and my clippings. And then my samples are books that I want to purchase, but I'm not going to right now. Um, they're books, you know, I have all those free books that I could read before I start purchasing books. Uh, but there are some books that I really want to read that I might purchase soon. Um, this one's called On the Road by Jack Kerouac. I hope I pronounced that right. A Child Called It by Dave uh, Pulitzer, which I actually read a long time ago and decided I wanted to reread it. The Girl Who Was on Fire by Leah Wilson. Um... The Underland Chronicles by Suzanne Collins. That's a series that I want to read by her. Uh, she also wrote the Hunger Games series, of course. Uh, the Fault in Our Stars by John Green. The Fifty Shades of Grey by E.L. James. And that is a trilogy. And The Last Promise by Richard Evans. Um... So those are the samples that I got. I usually just get a sample before I purchase a book. Um, and those are the ones that I got. So I'll probably 
be reading those in the future. The first one I think I'm going to get is The Fault in Our Stars and then maybe The Last Promise. That's what I'm thinking. If I get the Fifty Shades of Grey, then I have the other two books to get as well. And same with the Underland Chronicles. Um, there's five books on that series, so if I get the first one, I'm going to have to go and get the other ones as well. So I'll probably read the other books first. Um, let's see, in my other books category... I have my Bible there. I have the Hunger Games official movie companion, illustrated movie companion. Ah, uh, the Hunger Games craze. Are you my? These are all children's books. These four here. Are you my mother? By P. D. Eastman, which is a really cute book. Um, my daughter loves when I read to her, so I have a few books on here for her. But Curious George. Um. The Ugly Ducky and the Pokey Little Puppy. You know. Uh, let's get home. And then I have the Twilight series here. And the Hunger Games series. Yeah, so I'll just show you. I got... And these, the Twilight series, I actually got for free. All four books are free on here. And I, got, I didn't get them from the Kindle store. I got them from website and I can't think of it off hand but it um I'll put it in the description it was an EPUB site and then I just converted them to Mobi uh, so they can be read on the Kindle um and then I'll show you the Hunger Games series these books were not free but because I got them from the Amazon store but actually, I believe the Hunger Games series is on that website as well. So if you haven't gotten the Hunger Games series or the Twilight series or, you know, one or both, whatever, I believe they're both on there and they're free. So I will let you know what that website is. And it's really simple to um, do. I have software on my computer that converts them. Uh, it's really simple. You just download the file to your computer. It's an EPUB format, and then you just hook your Kindle up. And uh, maybe I'll do a video on how to do that. But you just hook your Kindle up, and you convert the file to Mobi, and then you just um, transfer it to your Kindle. Um, let me see. I think that's all the books I have. Um, I will go through my archived items for you guys. Most of them are children's books because, you know, I have kids and I like, they, you know, they like when I read to them. And this is 40 fun stories for 48 year olds. Um, Ariel's birthday surprise, Belle, the mysterious message, Bubble Butt, the sea turtle. Burley and Grom, here, I don't know what this is, and the Secret City, Cinderella, Cougar Cub Tales, I'm Just Like You, Dracula, which is free, Girls to the Rescue Book 1, um, there's Hostile Witness that I was talking, excuse me, I was talking about. That's by Rebecca Forster, and that is free. Howie's Tea Party. Uh, let's see. If You Have a Hat, a Silly Rhyming Children's Picture Book. Um, most of these children's books were free as well. I can't remember, you know, which ones exactly, but I know they, most of them were. Um, the Jungle Book was free. Uh, Judy B. First Grader, and Jingle Bells, Batman Smells, and that one was free as well. The Last Call, hold on, let's see, The Last Call by George Weir, 
and I think I want to put that one. I'm going to put that one in my um, to read list. Okay. The last song by Nicholas Sparks, um, which I already read. Little Shoes, a, what is it? A Colorful Children's Picture Book. That one was free. Um, this is a, well, this is a zoology book. Um, Lives of Eminent Zoologists. It was free, but it, it was for something my daughter was doing in school, so. The Lucky One by Nicholas Sparks. That was really good. And then I have some uh, National Geographic issues here. Night Owl. Owl and Cow. Then again, the study of zoology. That was, you know, free, but it was for a school thing. PC Magazine. I just have one issue there. Perfect Timing by Jill Mansell. When you meet the man of your dreams on the night of your wedding. It's a very long title, but um, that was that was a pretty good book. I think I will read some more of her books actually. Um, Real Ghost Stories by William Steed. That was free. The Scarlet Letter um, by Nathaniel Hawthorne was free as well. The Shack by William P. Young. That was not free, but that was a really good book. Um, it was very emotional, but, um, Squidge, Little Elf, Big Trouble, I think, yeah. That was free. A lot of these children's books are free. Stick Dog Wants a Hamburger. Still I Rise, The Story of Ma Maya Angelou by Jeff Biggers. Uh, the Child of Peter Rabbit, that was free. When Cows Fly was free. And then I have some more things for school. Who was Elvis Presley? Who was Rosa Parks? Those were school uh, research things. Then Witch and Wizard by James Patterson, which I read, and it was pretty good. Took took me a little while to get into it, but it was all right book. So that's all the books that I have in my Kindle. You know, all the the books I have on my device and all the books that I don't have on my device. Um, if you have any questions, if you want me to go in depth about any of them, let me know and, and I will try to do a video on that for you guys. Um, please like the video and subscribe and I'll talk to you guys later.